Hey guys, Malcolm here. In this lecture I will give you a detailed introduction of application we are going to build together. This lecture is optional, so if you don't want to see detailed introduction, feel free to skip this. For those ones that are staying here, let's start. Ok, so here is our application and as you can see, here is a first screen of our application. First screen is login screen. So when you launch your application, you will see login screen, but if you are already logged in, you will see home screen. Ok, so we can log in, and in a case you are not registered, you can go to register screen. Alright, so here is a register screen, we can still navigate to our home screen and we can see here uh, meetups. Ok, so you can see here food festival, Batman screening, and all of the meetups here, I am still able to visit them, but I don't have all the permissions. So you can see here up here menu, in this menu we can go to login screen, we can go to register screen, we can visit meetup, so let's visit meetup here. Here is some additional date details about our meetup, so meetup creator, meetup creator avatar, date of a meetup, title of a meetup, subtitle, category, from time to time, some description and number of people that are joined in. As you can see I am not logged in, so I, have, I don't have access to threads here and people here. So I cannot click here, actually I cannot click here, but I can see here warning that I need to log in in order to access this menu, ok? So let's log in, or actually let's create a new user, so I will go back here and let's go to our login screen. Alright, so we are on a login screen and we can uh, log in, but first if we don't have a user we need to register, so let's register a new user. Alright, so let's register user, let's uh, choose your name. Let's say John Smith. So John Smith, username will be Smith, uh, let's say Smith11, alright. Email address will be smith at gmail.com and I hope I already don't have this user, so let's see. And avatar URL, so avatar of your user, for this I will get here. Alright, so here is the avatar. Alright, let's paste it here. And a password for our user, let's say smith1234 and a password confirmation smith1234. Let's submit. And you have been successfully registered, feel free to log in now. Perfect! So now we can now we can log in. So let's write here smith at gmail.com and let's put here password smith. One, two, three, four. But I will put here also five, so you will see that we are handling also errors. So five here, submit, and you can see invalid password or email. So we are handling all of the errors. I can log in again. So smith at gmail.com. Okay, smith1234, submit, and we are redirected to our home screen, which is our meetups. Okay, you can see I am logged in, I am displaying avatar of our user and also its username. I can log out here, then I will open this menu up here. You will see that I have additional options here to create meetup and log out. Alright, so let's say I want to go to food festival. So visit meetup and now I can join in here. So let's click here, join in. And you will see that we incremented number of people here. So now it's uh, one people here. <laughs> okay, we should display person, but it really doesn't matter right now. So we are, display, we, are, we are incrementing, we are changing our view and also we allowed now, as you can see, allow threads and a people here. Okay? So when I will click here threads, you will see that there are no threads yet here. Of course, this is a new meetup. Let's see people and there is just me, John Smith. Okay, when I will leave this meetup, I will be redirected to my detail view here and also this disabled again. Ok, so let's continue and let's see some other meetups. Let's say Batman screening. Maybe here are more people and yes, there is one person already. I can join in and there are two people now. I can see threads and you can see there are multiple threads here and also some posts. Ok, but just from one, one user. Ok, let's say I want to go, I want to see people here. There are multiple people, there's me and also some Kevin here. Ok, perfect. What if I would like to create my own meetup? Of course you can do it. Let's go back here, I can click on a menu and I can create a meetup and there is very nice form for us. So let's say I want location of New York, title will be let's say summer festival 
uh, date will be, we have a nice calendar, date will be in a July of 8. Let's click here. OK, category will be, let's say, party. OK, image, we will get image. So let's get our meetup image. All right, let's paste it here. Short info, very nice short festival description. We can provide here multiple lines. So uh, some nice festival in New York City. It's uh, gonna be awesome. Time from, we can choose here time. So let's say time will be from uh, from uh, five until uh, let's say until oops not eight not six thirty but let's say until twenty three. Let's submit, and as you can see, uh, this meetup is created. We are displaying our user and also information about our meetup. We can go to threads, no threads yet, of course, no people here because there is nobody joined in our meetup, and yeah, now we can. Log out. We have been successfully logged out. We are displaying a nice message. And we can log in as a different user. I created multiple users for you. So philip at gmail.com, password test test, submit. Now I'm logged in as a different user. You can see here my summer festival, visit meetup. I can join this festival and I can see all of these informations. All right, guys, so that's our application. And in the process of creating, you will learn tons of very useful stuff, uh, very, very useful for a Flutter. So you will learn um, about the blocks, about the uh, services, about the providers, about different types of a widget, like a stateful widget, stateless widget, inherited widget. We'll create a, our own architecture for uh, different providers and so on, but you will see it in a course. Don't forget that in a the course there is also included a Dart introduction. There is around, I think, 50 lectures where you will learn the basics of a Dart language. So guys, that should be it for introduction of application we are going to build together. And I hope to see you in a course. See you around, guys.